All right, this is my heavy metal journal. So we're gonna start with the dangles on the sides. Those are super cute. Two sets of them. The first set is all on these hooks right here that have glossy accents on them. And they're super stiff and hard and each one has a grommet on the end. Brad here with metal. All the binder rings, I used a ton of binder rings on here. Metal paper clip. Paper clip with a gem. Audrey Hepburn helped with the Nazis. Okay, here is helped against the Nazis. Let's be careful about that. So grommets, jump rings, a brad here. This is um, texture paste with Tim Holtz tinted embossing on it. I had to reinforce, I had to reinforce my card because it was too flimsy for all the metal I was putting in this book. Um, this is Dr. Maya Angelou. And here is a paper clip with jump rings, a paper clip, another gem. Let's see, okay, now we have just a really cool tag with a Tim Holtz saying. This says something of potions, elixirs and potions, sweet. And there's some more of that texture paste. We got Oprah, and Oprah has speckles on them. That is from uh, Dina Wakeley's gel gloss. So there's little speckles all through it. This is just acrylic paint. Um, this tag is really cool. I like how this turned out. That has glossy accents on it to keep it stiff, too. I had to use a lot of glossy accents to make stiff holders. Um, okay, that is a Tim Holtz bead. Amelia Earhart. And then I used a bunch of these. These are um, embellishments for wedding gowns and mother of the bride gowns. And I used a lot of lace in this one this lace is holding on the bottom here and here this is a metal ruler that comes in and out i just got the xoxo um, punch i love it and and i did all of these i have a another video showing you how i did all of the names using tissue paper and then also how i make these uh reinforcers it's a diy i have a free printable you can make your own reinforcers but that worked out great. These are all tissue paper with acrylic paint on them. And then this is a mix of stamping. The grunge is a mix of stamping. And then I used archival black around all the pages. Um, and this is Judge Soda Sotomayor. Here's another tag with some texture paste, some more of that fun embossing glaze that Tim Holtz does. Um, here is a vintage probably 1970s, 1980s earring, and then more embossing glaze, a fun brad up there, and then Frida. I'm not sure if I have her name spelled wrong. Some more, that's just lace. That turned out really well. And then what I did was I used some uh, Distress Ink to knock it back, because it was really, really bright. Uh-oh, I'm gonna have to put some of this stuff away or it won't, or it won't close. And then here is the back, and this was some uh, texture paste, and then the heavy metal. The thing about doing the words onto tissue paper first is you can't really mess it up, right? And then more of the reinforcer labels, and then a piece of that. I stapled a lot of this in. Um, I know a lot of people worry about using staples, but honestly, once you're done, you can't even see them in the, in the, Grand scheme of things with all this stuff in here. Okay, that one has to go this way because this one has one, but this was super fun to make, so I hope you like it. Tara Jacobson, Artsy Fartsy Life.